high, you know? I want to feel high, I want to feel like really wine, I want to feel like that. Uh, the, 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 the reason behind, there are many reasons, but uh, the big reason is mobile psychology, curiosity, desperation, hard life, lack of education about drugs, and so and so on. So, when I was in college, to 2011, 2011 at DIT, the Lesla Institute of Technology, I was there taking Biomedical Equipment Engineering, BEE. But I come from those, I started in Form 2, you know, Form 2 is a full church class. I started there many, many years ago. When I was there as second year, I got a place to volunteer at Mohimbiri so that I can get some experience and help them. It reached a time, due to using of drugs, I pull over my clothes and remain naked and enter into the street. It was very messy at that time. You can see how much, how far drugs take me from the top to the bottom. After that, I go many, 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 many problems and challenges and obstacles of life like a uh, thief, you know, I was a thief. I want to succeed, I want to get the drugs. And the drugs have already made me to be an addict, to get addiction of drugs. To be, to be like, uh, it's just like a slave, whether you want or not. Frankly, I'd like to dedicate my sincerely gratitude to God Almighty, my fellowship, and my respected guests who have, we have today. <clears throat> My name is Imani Kimaro, and I'm recovering at it. Here's my personal story. I was born here in Dar es Salaam in 1990, August 16th. By that time, my mother and my father were living separately. I'm a first born to my mom with two more brothers and one sister. My father had another family with six brothers and sisters. So I was living with my grandpa. I'm grateful to my messenger, Tony, rest in peace. That is my short personal story. Thank you! Thank you! I could just be doing those things in my mind. After that, I just started in third life. I was joining the gangs, you know, doing all the crazy stuff. But it didn't help me. I was born 1995, and this is my speech. I am 25 years old and from Zanzibar. I'm not married, but I do have a boyfriend. I started using drugs at the age of 20, where I was at college, St. John's University, Dodoma. I used to skip classes so that I can go to my friend's place and smoke weed. I did that almost every day, and that became my addiction. Wherever it's class time, I go to my friend's place and smoke drugs. I failed college and my dad sent me to try a clinical officer's training center. I continued using drugs while studying. I was able to keep my studies, so I passed my studies. I went to continue my studies at Kesanti School of Farmers, Kilimanjaro Moshi, where I started seeing the results of using drugs. I could get any kind of drugs if it's weed, cigarette, or alcohol just to get my hype on. I developed that lifestyle in which I had a lot of people, especially people close to me, my parents. Due to that, I felt shame, fear, and loneliness. In our Bronx, in Kongresi Mkua Kampunia Bronx Entertainment Company, you know, you see Shane Maswala and Ziki, uh, promotions are Sani, Kampunia Nakwanda events. Nikiunga. Mabu Vipi. Yeah, um, it's an honor for me to be here. Um, I feel really, really special. And for me as a musician, I feel like um, it's good for me to always you know, visit you guys, especially like what you guys are going through. Um, for me, I've never been experienced anyone in my family in Zimbabwe, you know. It's my first time being at a sofa house, but we could like be accent, you know. But um, one thing that I want to say is that, you know, I'm proud of you guys, like I'm really, really proud of you. And I know a lot of people, you know, like out there, it takes a lot of courage, you know. It takes a lot of mental strength. Um, it takes someone that has like the ability to come here. And 
my wish is that you guys you do your processes uh, properly, you finish up, and when you go out, you know, you just change your life. Uh, for me, I'm from Zimbabwe. Um, you don't really have things like this. And, you know, especially that girl that just came out, the story, like, she's like 25, I'm like 22, you know, and I can relate, you know, and for me, uh, I think in my music also I'm going to be speaking about a lot of drug, drug abuse and yeah, so just stay positive, stay strong. I have a song that DJ is playing, um, Co by Co, featuring Nancy C. Um, I say never gave up, now I'm dancing, you feel me? So please don't give up. Um, I'm sure I'll be back here soon before I leave. I'll be back and I'm sure I'll donate something and you know, I'll just get back. Oh yeah, they're in the car. So I just pray that you guys will Keep on going and you know, just stay tuned. Thank you so much. Who is going to go? Oh, I 